Hello. It's not me, Mario. Okay, I'm not the original Mario, but, you know, yeah, I don't have a mustache, and I don't have a hair, and I don't have a hat, you know, so I can't be Mario, but I, uh, but I am Kippy Love, and this is Precious Love right here, Precious Love, and Aspen Love, come here, boy, you want to get up here over here, come here, Aspen, over here, do you want a treat, come here, over here. There, and this is Aspen Love, Aspen Love, Precious and Aspen Love, and Kippy Love. We're the Love family, yeah. And uh, we're going to, here, sit right here. We're uh, going to try uh, some goodies today. I have three of them right here in front of me. One is uh, made with lemon, and one is made with uh, uh, guava, guava cheese. And another one is made with bear. Ooh, that don't sound too good. Bear? Ugh. Don't know. I've never had bear. No. And buffalo. Buffalo balls, but never had bear balls. <laughs> well, okay. We won't go there. But anyway, um, I've uh, done Bon Appetit before. And, uh... I've found some of these somewhere else that I usually go. And so I said, well, let me pick these up. So the first one, uh, we're going to try like uh, the bear claw. Bear claw. It's, it shows it's got like uh, wheat and... Meow, meow. The cat wants to go outside. Silly cat. It looks like it's got some nuts in here and uh, some kind of wheat, barley, or whatever it is. But it's called the Bear Claw by Bon Appetit. You can see all the nuts and wheat or whatever that is in there. And you can see it on the actual uh, Bear Claw itself. We're going to go ahead and try some of the Bear Claw and see what we think. Hold on. i got to break a piece off. I don't want to get too much out. It's got a high smell, like, um, it's like higher pitch than, here, gotta get back now. Uh, smells higher than, like, cinnamon. Not sure what that smell is. I really can't tell, but it looked like maybe some kind of a, uh, apricot type thing. I don't know if it's apricot, but some kind of you know, whatever. Let's let the babies have a bite. Here's one for you. And here's one for you. Yeah, she decided to sit in front of me. And I'm going to try a bite. She next door. She wants to go so bad. She's like, let me out. Let me out. Mm. Let's see if I can. It said, uh, I can't read this. It's so small. Um, let me see what the ingredients is. Uh, I see egg whites in it. No, I don't see what the flavor is, uh, but it tasted a little bit like apricot. All right, get back. But uh, yeah, this is the bear claw. And if you know what's uh, in the bear claw, since I can't see it, it's so small writing, it's like, yeah, I'll even put it right here so you can look at it. It's so small from my eyes, and I even have glasses on. Well, we'll go to the next one. We're going to go with the, uh, cheat. Uh, you better not get off. Get your butt back up here. Get back up here. Messing with the cat. I mean, excuse me. I got to spank my baby. Now, don't mess with that kitty cat. 
That kitty cat doesn't do nothing to you. Leave that kitty cat alone, you bad boy. You don't even get to try this next one. You're so mean. No, get back. Get back. you in trouble. These children nowadays, they just think they own the world. But this is a guava cheese Danish. It looks like that. And smells more like a Danish with a cream cheese in it. They always put these things. Uh, let me, oh, that one tore almost in half. It does look like it's got a. Uh, I can't see the color. It looks like it's got some kind of a gel, jelly in there. That might be, it says guava cheese, so that's probably the guava and the cheese. Guava is the fruit, I guess. And then the cheese is beside it, guava cheese. So we're going to take a bite of this. Here you go. I'll give you a bite. I'm not totally mean to you. And you get a bite. Yeah, guava's kind of like, kind of like a, um, it's like a sour peach or something. It tastes like a sour peach to me. Um, it was kind of a mix, though. It had the cream cheese and uh, guava together. So I was probably getting the, the cream cheese flavor mixed with the guava. So it was kind of, kind of different. Mm -hmm. Let me just try the guava itself and not the cheese. There's just the guava. Well, it didn't taste like peach that time. It was, I guess, the cheese made a, made it taste like a sour, uh, uh, sour peach. But I don't know. That was kind of weird. You know, it's kind of different. You know, it didn't really have any flavor. The guava, the guava, the fruit didn't really have any flavor to it, really. Not until I had it with the cheese and the Danish. And it tasted more like a peach. You know, sour peach or whatever. But, uh, that was pretty good. I like it all together. And the, uh, Bear Claw, all these were fresh. Just like, they're all fresh, fresh, fresh. Now we're going to try the, uh, lemon. Lemon cream. Lemon cream Danish. I'm trying to steal my dang food. All of them smell the same, really. I mean, on the outside, the package, they all smell the same because the Danish, I guess, is... Boy, you stubborn mule. Not until you open it up and smell the inside, but you can see the lemon in there right there, the lemon. Really can't smell the lemon, but you can smell the Danish real good. I mean, is that a bite? Mmm. Mmm. Now that one. Mmm. Mmm. Mm. Now that one was good. Mmm. Well, that was, but it says uh, lemon, so it's kind of lemon, lemon. I don't know if it's lemon, lemon. You know, it's like lemon and 
orange, I mean, lemon and lime mixed together? I'm not sure. <laughs> mm. It might be lemon and lime mixed together or something like that. Because it, it's like the picture shows the outside looks like a lime, I mean a lemon, but the inside looks like a, a lime. So I guess lemon, le lemon, I don't know, can't, can't tell, it's weird. I don't know, I can't read anyway, but anyway, if you get a chance to buy any of these, and uh, of course, uh, the lemon um, one was my favorite, and then I would have to say the guava cheese, because I could taste the cream cheese in there, and then the uh, bear claw, you know, was good too. Now, like I said, you know, all of them are fresh, all of them are delicious. You got the lemon cream danish. You got the guava cheese Danish, and you got the bear claw Danish. It doesn't say Danish, but it's a bear claw, and they're all from Bon Appetit. And uh, if y'all get a chance to get some of Bon Appetit pies, they're good, you know. Now the Mexican ones, the uh, Bono Bono Appetito or Bon. Buno, Buno, I guess it was pronounced. I think it was Buno uh, Appetito. You know, maybe that's the Mexican style. Most of them are, to me, in my my preference, you know, and the way these taste and the way the Bun, Buno Appetito or whatever they're called, they're a little bit more dry and they're not as sweet as these versions are. But they, they're still good. Boy, that girl, she just, she wants to go out so bad. She wants to, see, it, it's when she was with us at the other house, she got to go out and be, disappear for, you know, all day. She'd go hide out in the woods or go play somewhere and everything, and then she'd come back. We were always afraid that, you know, one day she might not come back. And now... She wants to do that here, and we got a fenced yard, and she's trying, she's already scoping out, like, hey, I can climb that tree and get over the fence, or I can climb that fence and get lost, you know, and disappear, you know, and she can't do that in this area. This is a lot different. You got a lot more roads, you got a lot more dogs and, and people around here, you know, it's not like where she had a big open, like, 20-some acre property, you know, so it's a lot different here. But anyway, um, that's our video. Y'all have a awesome day and a perfect tomorrow. We'll catch y'all at Scratching Post where we can meow about, you know, you're not going to butter up. You're not going to butter me up putting your, getting closer to me just so you can get another bite of this. I see you right there. See, you can see us. Is, come here. I see, come here. Come here. I see you right here. Everybody knows you right here. I see your nose right there. <laughs> Trying to get get me to give him some more of this stuff. He says it's so good. But anyway, um, if you find any of this catnip flavor, you know, Danish, uh, let me know. Because I need to find it so I can eat some of it. I love catnip. But anyway, bye.